वेलकम टू तरुण आई एस माई नेम इज रोहित कुमार टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू अटार्ट ट्वेल्थ सेप्टेम्बर द करेंट अफेयर विच इज टेकन फ्रॉम द हिंदू एंड इंडियन एक्सप्रेस दिस न्यूज इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर यूर एग्जामिनेशन यू पी एस सी फिल्म्स एंड द मेन्स एग्जाम एंड अनदर एग्जाम ऑल्सो बिकॉज वी जस्ट ट्राई टू मेक अ प्रोपर फ्रेमवर्क to all the newspaper which is important for us for our examinations so let's talk about this news ki what is important here first news india stay out of trade policy pillars at indo pacific meet it's uh, the hindu news and in indian express it's a uh, given the hindu the indian india opt out to ipef trade pillar to await a final contours this is the indian express so now we have to discuss about a uh, simply on the behalf of uh, what is the important of this news in the prelims exam so first of that ki maybe ipef come in exam maybe uh, ipef will ask in our examinations prelims examination and we already we discussed to rcep rcep regional comprehensive economics partnership and the ipec it means uh, indo pacific economic framework so we are going to discuss to both first of all that a uh, start so what is the news news is here sitting to concern over the discriminations against to developing countries we already we know that uh, there is a mainly three type of the country on the base of development one is a developed country another is a developing country and one another is a under developing country india pakistan we can't be say as a pakistan but india china and the some type of the nepal and all these type of the country is a developing country so we are developing country so india see that uh, this country just try to discriminate with the developing country so india stay out of joint declarations on the trade pillar of us led indo pacific economic framework us led united states of america led it so ipef indo pacific economic framework and the india just stay out from to all this because india is saying that ki this country developed country is uh, discriminating with the developed developing country so ministerial meeting into los angeles so one questions may be asked IPEF was held in Los Angeles Los Los Angeles is a uh, uh, one of the important beautiful city in USA United States of America state of United so what is the stand of india why india what is the stand india stand a uh, stand say india was uh, only one of the 14 IPEF so you can say that there was a uh, 14 member in IPEF there was a uh, 14 member of IPEF Uh, indo pacific economic partnership india is also the member of this country including the south east asia country australia new zealand south korea japan but they not join the declarations on the trade so what is the reason behind this reason simply said that reason is staying out and saying that the contour of the framework had not emerged it particularly on environment particularly in the labor particular in the digital marketing or digital trade and the public procurement it means simply say that keep right now we everyone saying that ki indo pacific economic uh, framework here but now in the areas of digital marketing in the areas of environment in the areas of labor all this area right now also is not make the any framework in ip ef so that's why they want to a staying out from the ipec so so mirror mirrors india's decisions to walk out from the regional comprehensive economic partnership you already we know that india just to stay out walk out from the comp regional comprehensive economic partnership with that same things ipef that's also be included in china so china was also the part of this so first of all let me start you what is a ipef 
and the why it is important or why India is a, a stay out. We already we know that simply we should know something related to IPF. So what is the IPEF? So IPF Indo-Pacific Economic Partnership. There is a 14 member in the IPEF, 14 member in the IPF partnership and the 40% of global GDP represent in IPEF also. So one thing is also a 28% global goods and services. There is a four pillar, mainly four pillar which is uh, representing in IPF. First pillar, it's uh, related to trade. Second pillar, it's related to supply chain. Supply chain, anything, goods and services, whatever you can say in there. And third, clean energy, decarbonization infrastructure. It means non-renewables energy, wind energy and all these things and the fourth tax and anti-corruption so these four pillars of ipef it's a important for so this is a very important news for us our for examinations to all these things move on another news so another news it's uh, related to india and uk united kingdom you already we know that the prime minister new prime minister of united kingdom kingdom is uk is lee strass so lee strass lee strass new president okay rishi sunak just defeated so what is the it's a part of international relationships and indian prime minister narendra modi just spoke with his new uh, british counterpart and the uh, congratulated her on the appointment and say that uh, maybe in the future India UK make or build a strong relationship to each other they are trying to making that's why he also appreciated to uh, appreciate to contributions of India UK bilateral relationship to previous role to trade secretary and uh, foreign secretary also so now they are they are just trying to discussing or they are trying to make a roadmap of 2030 it's a, a one thing you are it's a multi-dimensional framework between india and uk and these frameworks will be held to free trade deal also defense and security pact and people to people ties so though maybe indian and uk bilateral will be a strong for the both country and the both the people of a country so it's a very also important this news now move on to another news which is related to Madhya Pradesh so this is a very important first you, uh, you can see you know first of all that uh, right to life is a fundamental rights which is mentioned in article 21 uh, it's a fundamental rights but now there is a very very important news related to MP Madhya Pradesh is a first state in India who will draft a suicide prevention strategy you know what is the reason behind that people commit a suicide so this is a very relevance related to government policies or interventions I made to development to various sector but here Madhya Pradesh it's a first state Madhya Pradesh will be the first state in the country to prepare a suicide prevention a strategy and it's a very important so what is the reason so why the people commit the suicide maybe due to reason of the uh, anxiety stress depressions maybe due to loss of the money loss of the you can see that pressure to all this a lot of the things can happen in the life life always we make up and down and when life goes on down people just depressed and that type people uh, could not be think anything what i have to do what is right and what is wrong in that conditions people take such type of the state so government try to just help to all such type of the people who feel like that so mp will be just first a state of the country who will prepare and drop to suicide uh, pre uh, a prevention a strategy so mp government madhya pradesh government will make a task force task force for which type of the task force task force comparing like a psychiatrist task force in included in legal expert 
and the researcher academians and the social worker has been formed for this to make or aware the people who will think like that so task of each subcommittee or each subcommittee has been given to a specific mandate such thing like that first of all that understanding to so so sociological factor because we will have to understand what is the reason behind and we will do something so second thing is uh, suggesting to preventing method how to prevent how to uh, stop such type of the activity in the society this is also the part of the task force and the visions way to raise a mass awareness because committing suicide is a crime in the fundamental rights right to life is a fundamental right but right to die is a not fundamental right it's a crime or uh, the people do like such activity definitely will be a a crime suggesting a new method for a training of the professionals and individuals and looking at how the laws can strain or dilute to improve the situation and understanding to intersectoral linkage to suicide prevention so all these all these ways just included in the task force on the method that mp government tried to prevent to all this activity it's a nonsense activity you are thinking you have a single life and in the single life you are feeling to depress just try to get out from this things no need to feel like a depression we have to do something different we have to live the life okay so what is the reason behind to suicide uh, strategy in the main mp just take us uh, some data here you can say data is that as a per accidental death and suicide in india see here suicide suicides in india as per accidental death and suicide in india 2020 it's a report of the national crime bureau report national crime report bureau so 115052 suicides were reported in the country see here 1153052 suicides were reported in the country by ncrb national crime report bureau and the 14578 reported from mp third highest country in the third highest the third highest in the country estimate 17.4% suicide rate it was above to nations average that's why mp government just make some a strategy to prevent the suicide so this is a important report of ncrb and move on to another news so this is important so this is all about to all these things so we will meet in another videos so keep a study watch the video thank you very much we will meet another videos thank you